the kingdom descended? The Lord has returned and expressed new words? Is it true? Of course it's all real. The Lord Jesus has indeed returned. It is the incarnate Almighty God. The Lord prophesied, For as the lightning comes out of the east and shines even to the west, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. Eastern lightning's appearance fulfills the Lord Jesus' prophecy. Pastors and elders of the religious world accuse and resist Eastern Lightning. All this proves Eastern Lightning couldn't be the true way. Don't you two ever believe it? The pastors and elders often study and interpret the Bible. To investigate the true way, we need to listen to them. The CCP and the religious world both accuse Eastern Lightning. We should stop investigating. The CCP's an atheist party. They've always persecuted house churches. How could we ever believe them when they accuse a church? Do the pastors and elders possess the truth? Are they able to hear the voice of the Lord? Can they recognize the appearance of the Lord? Jewish religious leaders were familiar with the scriptures and often interpreted them for others. But then when the Lord Jesus appeared and worked, were they able to hear God's voice in the Lord Jesus' words? Did they lead believers to welcome the Lord Jesus? We read Almighty God's words. We all admit they are the truth. Why would you believe the CCP and the pastors and elders' condemnation of you? All right, all right, enough. I think we should listen to the pastors and elders. It's safer to believe in our church. If one believes in God without hearing or obeying God's word, and instead believes the fallacies and lies of the CCP and the pastors and elders of the religious world, can such people be called believers in and followers of God? Almighty God says, while seeking the footprints of God, you ignored the words that God is the truth, the way, and the life. So when many people receive the truth, they do not believe that they have found the footprints of God, and much less acknowledge the appearance of God. What a serious error that is! The most basic principle in investigating the true way is to look at whether this way has the truth, whether it has the voice of God. The one who can express the truth must be the appearance of Christ. None of corrupt humanity can do that. It's a true and indisputable fact. But now I finally understand. As we investigate the true way, if we don't focus on hearing God's voice and instead listen to the rumors and lies of the CCP government and the religious pastors and elders, we will lose our chance to gain salvation and enter the kingdom of heaven and be extinguished in the great disaster. Just as the Bible says, fools die for want of wisdom.